everyone welcome back to my channel i know it has been such such a long time since i have recorded and it's just um, oh we got a special guest over here hi hatch um it's been such a long time since i have recorded on youtube um i have been a little bit more active on instagram um if you guys don't follow me i am Pop xo on instagram um but yes today i thought i would do a video on my tiffany oh my god on my tiffany collection it's not big it's very small but there's some pieces that are more affordable and some that i got for valentine's i got for myself and just gift ideas for those who want something from tiffany's but a little bit more on a budget i'll also talk about that as well in this video okay so the first item that i have from tiffany and co i would say it's my first um non-jewelry piece is my glasses these are just my prescription glasses that I recently got. They're just big round prescription glasses. Um, it has the T's on the side here. And then it has the little Tiffany blue on the ends. It just says Tiffany & Co. made in Italy. So this is how my prescription glasses look. They're very big. I like big glasses because I have a big face. So I need to cover a lot. So I really like these. These are brand new to me. Um, they did have them in red. Um, I think a gray and black. So if you're interested, I'll leave like the name of it down below if I could find it. So yeah, these are my Tiffany and Co. glasses. So another item that I have from Tiffany and Co. that is non-jewelry is a card holder. I just recently got this for Christmas. My fiance actually got it for me. It is this Tiffany blue card holder. And it has one, two slots, one in the middle. I don't know if you guys can see. And then two more in the back. It just says, please return to Tiffany. And it's in a Tiffany blue. I have not used this yet. Um, I need to use it. So it comes with this little dust bag and it came with the bag also. Um, so this was a Christmas gift that I got. I believe this was $225 if I'm not mistaken. Um, I really like this. It smells like you can smell the calfskin leather. I think it's calfskin. Um, but you can smell the leather. So I really like it. And... It's a very nice piece that I have. So it comes in this Tiffany blue box and it comes with a little dust bag when you purchase. Where is he hatching? When you purchase it. So it, it is an actual necklace. Um, it has the Tiffany blue turned to Tiffany and then it transitions to the Tiffany blue. And like that. So I'm not going to try this on because this does not fit me that well. This is actually too small. This is a 16 inch chain and it fits me like a choker. So I'm not going to try this on. Uh, I just want to show you guys how it looks. Um, it's very nice. I actually got this for Valentine's Day. My fiance got this for me for Valentine's and I really like it. I just haven't used it yet. So I did go on Amazon and purchase another silver chain. It should be coming next week um, to replace this one. Um, you could go inside the store, but I believe they do charge you extra if you want a longer chain. So I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to pay $100 plus if I could just get one from Amazon. Um, silver. And it does the same thing. So I'm going to wait for that piece to come in and then I'll be wearing this all the time. So this is a Tiffany & Co. blue little necklace. Okay, so the next piece of jewelry that I have from Tiffany & Co. is this bracelet. It has a Tiffany blue. And in the back, it has Return to Tiffany. And then it has a little diamond on the inside. I don't know if you guys can see that. It has a little diamond. If you hear noises, it's my dog hatching, biting the, biting the couch. So FYI. This is in the silver. So all the pieces that I have are in silver. Um, if you guys don't know, silver is, I guess, the more affordable piece. Are more affordable at Tiffany & Co. So if you want to, like, start your collection or just try some stuff out i recommend the silver i did hear that they might remove that line because they did sell so tiffany and co sold to a brand and that brand is rebranding the whole um tiffany and co brand so just keep that in mind if you are interested in the piece uh, i recommend buying it as soon as possible because i don't know if that is true or just a rumor so again, this is the bracelet. I'm not going to put this on also because I need help putting it on. So this is this fits my wrist, but it you need help putting it on. <laughs> um, or you could use it the tape. You could use a piece of tape and, and all that stuff. But this is how it would look on my wrist if you're interested. Um, 
yeah i'm not gonna try this on because i need help but it is a very nice piece i was wearing this every day but then i was like what if it tarnishes fast because i'm like washing dishes working and sweating working out and i don't want the silver to tarnish so i kind of stopped using it but this is a very nice piece i love it love it love it and it has a tiffany blue heart um which also matches the necklace set my fiance got me for valentine's day so it kind of goes together next piece from what i can feel is a heavier one um i really like this piece and i also got this idea from a fellow youtuber i can't recall her name but i'll put it on the screen um she actually gave me the idea of purchasing a pendant and creating your own necklace so i actually got this pendant here it says please return love tiffany and co nyc so it's a silver pendant with a tiffany blue and in the back it says tiffany and co and this is actually a pendant this is not the necklace that it came with so i bought the pendant the pendant was like a hundred dollars and then i went on amazon and bought the chain and it, it is perfect so this is how the chain looks on me i absolutely love it it is a very nice big heart and like i said the chain is actually from amazon um if i could link it down below i will it's just a regular silver sterling silver chain with the pendant that i purchased so the pendant actually came in this little dust bag right here and i just got the chain from amazon put it in and you're good to go so this is a very nice alternative piece if like i said if you're on a budget you want something from the line this is a nice way to go about it um like i said this is amazing um when i buy these pieces i'm very cautious of what you know how much they are how i can use in multi multiple ways this is actually a charm so you could actually put this on a bracelet as well so um tiffany and co actual actually has a bracelet that you could put charms in um so you could use it multiple ways like i said so i really like this one i'm gonna keep this one on and yeah this is my last piece so i actually got this one this is another charm that i got and i'm awaiting my chain from amazon amazon this is the little pink charm and it says return to tiffany on the back this was 90 bucks yes i know 90 bucks for this little charm and you might be like oh my god that's a lot of money for a charm yes but if you could convert it into a necklace it's like wow and it's tiffany and co even better you get the packaging you get the bag you get the little dust bag you get like a little card so you get like the whole experience for this little thing it is what it is i could also use this chain or any chain that i have for that charm but i like to keep my things like you know in order so i also ordered a chain for this but yes like i said this, these are the pieces that i've purchased like i said they don't break the bank you just have to be creative on your pieces um my next video i want to talk about my purses and my organizing that i've found on amazon oh my gosh this has been such a lifesaver that will probably be my next video i'm not sure yet hopefully i'm not MIA again but i hope you guys enjoy if you like these kind of videos please comment down below letting me know you do um if you are a returning subscriber hi i haven't seen you guys in such a long time and yes so this was supposed to be a tiffany and co jewelry but ended up being a tiffany and co as a whole i also have a tiffany and co jersey i haven't worn it i am actually selling that one because i don't need it so if you guys are interested in the tiffany and co jersey the one that they came out for the nfl the one that rihanna performed comment down below if you're interested i can send you some information about it but yes i'm also saying that one but it's in my closet in the box wrapped i'm not gonna open it um so yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video again 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 please comment down below subscribe if you have not already and then i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys mm -hmm.